Hi, morning. Thank you for joining us on the Early Rundown. So leading the news this Monday morning, the UK's first red extreme heat warning has come into force. The National Weather Service issuing the first ever extreme heat warning with forecast highs of 105 today and tomorrow. Hotter than the Sahara Desert and Delhi. With temperatures predicted to hit 40 degrees Celsius today or tomorrow and break the records for the UK's hottest ever day. Now there's currently a 90% chance that we're going to break the all-time UK temperature record which is 38.7 Celsius. We're likely to see that record being broken on Monday and again on Tuesday. Hello guys and welcome to a bit of an unconventional and a bit of an unplanned video. As you've probably guessed by the intro of this video and the title of this video, we're in the middle of a heat wave right now. This is probably the biggest heat wave that's ever been recorded in British history. It's the hottest day of the year and it's probably one of the hottest days if not the hottest day recorded ever in British history. It's 36 degrees where I live right now in Newcastle. But elsewhere in the UK it's reaching temperatures up to like 40 C. So yeah, it's pretty hot in the UK right now. I've came out here in the middle of nowhere. It's just a random patch of um, ground near where I live and I thought this would be the perfect location to do this. So yeah, I've got my pan there, sitting there gathering some heat right now in the sun. I've got my egg and I've got my cooking oil. I've always wanted to try this guys. And yeah guys, we're gonna cook an egg outside. Talk about saving some electricity. <laughs> so guys, here it is, the pan. It's been sitting here for about 15 minutes now. If I touch it now, oof, that is pretty hot. I think it'll cook the egg slowly, but I think it's probably just hot enough to cook the egg. This is probably the only day I could have probably done this on because it's hot enough to cook an egg in this temperature. But yeah, I'm looking forward to doing this, guys. I've got an extra camera there rolling that's gonna film a close-up of the egg cooking. And I've got, obviously, my main camera, which is the one you're watching right now. Let's do this thing. It may cook slowly, but I'm confident it'll work. I'm confident it'll cook. So yeah, let's do this. Let's cook this egg. Ugh. Got gravel all over my hands. <laughs> there we go, guys. Bit of oil. Maybe a bit too much oil. That's gonna hinder the cooking abilities a little bit. Let's crack the egg. Oh. Oops. Let's crack the egg. Oh. Oops. Come on, this might take a while, but I'm confident. Come on. If I had filmed this video about an hour and a half ago, it would have probably cooked a lot quicker than this. Um, not as um, good as I expected it to be. It's probably not hot enough. Ain't nobody got time for that. This well that's pretty hot, so you've got to take a drink once in a while. Ah, Rubicon. Can't beat a bit of Rubicon. <coughs> a few moments later. So yeah guys, I have to say I'm a little bit disappointed the egg hasn't really cooked at all. I mean, there's a little bit of white there, but I think that little bit of white was already inside the egg. It's bubbled a little bit on the surface, but it's not cooking. I think maybe either I put too much oil in, or it's the fact it's kind of clouded over now. It is still very, very hot. The air is very, very warm, but I just think the sun's just not getting through them clouds and unfortunately the egg hasn't cooked. <laughs> this has been an absolute fail of a challenge. I mean every single person who does challenges like this has failed sometimes and I guess this hasn't worked out. But yeah, yeah, it's one raw egg that hasn't cooked and I've got no idea what I'm going to do with the egg now. I'm probably going to throw it in the trees and it's going to attract loads of flies and maggots and stuff and maybe wild foxes at night time. <laughs> Delicious.
giving back to the environment, I guess, and giving Mother Nature a raw egg, but yeah. Oh, God. It was worth a try, guys. It's still very, very, very hot out here. You can probably tell by the sweat on my face. If I ever vlog in the future in a tropical country and it's very, 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 very hot, I'll try this challenge again. But unfortunately, it just wasn't meant to be this time. There's only one thing I can think of doing with this raw egg right now, and that's chucking it in them trees over there. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm taking the raw egg <laughs> up to the trees. This makes for a very interesting vlog in its own right. Who's ever vlogged throwing an egg into some trees before? I guess this is a first. Cheers, Mother Nature. He has an egg for you. Oof. Oh, God. Oh. What a feel. What a feel. Look at all my camera equipment and stuff I bought along as well just to film this video. It's just sitting there and... <laughs> it didn't happen! Anyway guys, thanks for watching this feel of a vlog. I hope you enjoyed it even though it didn't work out. At least Mother Nature's getting a nice treat tonight. I guess the foxes are going to be in the element with the raw egg just lying in the trees, but yeah. Oh. If anyone has successfully completed this challenge, then I applaud you because I, it didn't work out for me today, but yeah. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe. I know this was a fail, but I would love if you subscribed anyway because <laughs> I put a lot of effort into these videos, especially this one, which didn't work out. <laughs> But yeah, thanks for watching guys, and if you've managed to cook an egg properly in this weather, then I hope you enjoy the egg. Goodbye.